151 apiece. Exciting last over from Freiling, hitting two big sixes. And now they're back. Delport and Freiling have been sent by Chittagong Vikings. Khan bowling to Cameron Delport. Here he comes. First ball, he gets bat onto it. Over third man. That's gone for a boundary. First ball four. That's a good start. It is the super over for the very first time in the sixth edition of the BPL 2019. It was wide. And he's got the top edge and he's flew over the field infield and it's gone to the boundary. Yeah, third man has been pushed back now. There's a deep square leg. If you're bowling full wide outside the off stump, you might as well bring him in. Under the circumstances, it's not easy. Change of angles coming round the wicket. After a long discussion, the third man again comes back inside the circle. So they left the field like when it was in the first delivery. He's now coming over the wicket. Left arm. In the block hole. Well done. Single. So that's five now. Now, can Junaid Khan repeat what he did just about 10 minutes ago? Three dot balls to Freilink. The change of pace wasn't working very well for Freilink. He gave away only four runs in that over you're talking about. When in the field, it's the right-hander, Freilink, on strike. Will it be pace off? Slow bouncer in the air. Can Brathwaite get to it? It's gone over him. Oh, and we wait for the umpire signal. They're looking at each other. He's given it a boundary. Ranmo Martinez, captain not happy. Top edge works. Yeah, it's the top edge that does the trick for him. He was never in control. And just went over that fielder at short fine. Bradford nowhere near it. So four more. The score moves to nine in the first three deliveries. Not really sure, fine leg, third man inside the circle and the lengths that have been... Oh, beautiful ball, middle stump. That's the first one. Fantastic delivery to send back Freilink. Right on the money. You miss, I hit. He comes back strongly in the fourth delivery, Junaid Khan. Look at that delivery. Much straighter, hits the leg stump. Gone. They pick up their first wicket and also is a dot delivery. Yeah, well bowled from Freilink. The captain has come out. He will take strike now. Mushfiqur Rahim played a good knock just a while ago. But now he has to be in top gear. He's got two deliveries to himself. Nine already on board. Slower ball, bouncer. They'll go for one. I think they'll let Delport face the last ball. So it's ten for one now. Another very clever piece of bowling from Junaid uh, Khan. Everybody praying there. Team of delivery, but it was a slow, on the slower side. Never in control. Can Junaid Khan finish off nicely here? Mahmudullah Riyadh has come a, a long way to have a word with uh, Junaid Khan. Last ball. Can they make it 17 to win? No, that's a very, very good ball. Into the block hole again. So it's just a single of the last delivery. It's 12 to win this match for Kulna Titans. It can be done in two balls and it can be going the other way around if Vikings can bowl well when they come out. Big question, who do you feel is going to come out for these guys? Well, certainly it's going to like to see Carlos Brathwit to, to come uh, and uh, take strike. And the question is, uh, you can see that only 11 runs. So 12 to win for the Vikings. Hard work for Kulna to get their first two points. They should have never been in this position, but they still would feel that they have an upper hand because they're chasing. 
12 of six deliveries on a normal game, you'd say, yeah, it's gettable. 19 required in the last two. Super over, 12 required of the six deliveries. That is what Kulna needs here. And they've sent in the overseas players. Combination of left hand, right hand in the middle. Carlos Brethwood uh, will be eyeing uh, to finish it off uh, nicely for Kulna tight. And so will be David Milan. We'll have to wait and see who's going to take the ball. Try link. Not very far away from here, Athar, was Kolkata. Six, six, uh, four sixes in the final. Can he just take two out of them and put them here? He's bowled wild yorkers and uh, wide yorkers have worked for him. But keep in mind that Brathwaite's reach is completely different from other batsmen. He's got a lot of job to do. Brathwaite on strike. Super over. Full toss. Played for a single. Now then, it was a full toss. It was an opportunity for him to crash it uh, all the way over the long of field. Uh, only managed to pick up a single. Gets uh, Milan on strike. Bryling still coming round the wicket. Full toss again. He just drives that one. He's played it wide. Wow. Effortless shot for a boundary. That's a very good cricketing shot. It was a low full toss. Packed off side field. But uh, David Malan has played a beautiful shot. Lovely touch. Really good shot to pick up a boundary. You've got to find the gap. And he does that quite nicely. In that, just pure timing. Here comes Freilink again. This time onto the leg stump. They're going for one. Brathwaite can cover good ground in good time. Throw is wide. Two. To make sure they've gone upstairs. We'll have to wait. Is it seven or we are six? Yeah. Milan seems to be good and okay. Uh, the Dettol 100% shows uh, decision is. Has to be not out. He's fine. He's safe. Yeah, it is not out. Now they should get it. If they can manage to pick up another boundary here, then it will certainly uh, put a lot more pressure on Frylink. Any ball, a really good delivery here. Not concede a boundary. That is what uh, he wants to do. Five of three now. Oh, right through him. But Bradford goes for a single. He's out. Good work by Shazad. Underarm throw. And that is the end of Carlos Brathwaite. What a delivery. Fantastic delivery from uh, Freilink. Just cramping David, David Milan for room. Just going through the legs. And what about that throw from uh, Mohamed Shazad? On stumps. And he's well short, Carlos Brathwaite. Brilliant. Brilliant from Vikings. First it was Freiling and then it was uh, Shazad. Brathwaite run out for one. Seven for one. You would choose Paul Sterling in a situation like this. He can hit it hard, he can hit it out of the park. And he's got two deliveries to do that. Yeah, what about Robbie Freiling? What a game he is having. Every time he's come on to bowl or bat, he's produced the goods. Can he do it one more time? Excellent delivery, the last one, producing a, a wicket. Here comes Freilink. Round the wicket to Paul Sterling. Oh, full toss. It's gone. It will go for two minimum. Coming back quickly. In a position where he thought perhaps there was an opportunity to hit it out of the ground. Just got it on top of the bat. And it looked like pretty high. In the end, it's only two runs. Sure it did. They need a boundary. Oh, he's missed it. He has missed it. Just a single. That's the end of it. Chittagong Vikings have managed to squeeze their way through. And Robbie Freilink 
has done it once again for Chittagong Vikings. They won the Super over and they won this match. Mahela cannot believe it. Fought so hard for so long, but they're still unable to get their two points. Great work from uh, Robbie Freilink. Absolutely brilliant. Pulno Titans once again does not get on to the points table. Vikings go on to, uh, to win uh, in the Super Over. Brilliant stuff uh, from Freilink. First, it was the run out of Carlos Brathwaite, and then he came back very strongly. Bowl of full toss, which went for two, and then the last delivery. Keeping his composure and bowling a beautiful delivery, which resulted in only a single. In the end, Titans only could muster 10. They needed 12. Oh, well. <laughs> Kulna Titans needed a bit of luck coming their way. But not today. They've lost four out of four now. That's the last ball. Sterling misses it. Then underarm throw from Shazad. But they needed three to win this match. And a jubilant Vikings dugout. And what a tournament he's having up till now. Brilliant from Robbie Freiling. Already has a man of the match. And may as well get another. So that's the end of match 11. And it's uh, Chittagong Vikings who have uh, beaten the Kulna Titans in the Super Over. The target was 12. They managed to score 10. So here we are. This is what happened today. It was Vikings who won the toss, put uh, Titans into bat. 151 for six in there, 20. Balan got 45. Mamadullah 33. Good mark to chips there. And Sanzamul got those two all important wickets. And Vikings in reply got exactly that. 151 for eight in there, 20. Yasir Ali looked very promising. 41. Mushfiq got 34. And it was uh, Shoriful and Bradford who got uh, two wickets each. And this uh, match was a tie. And then went to the Super Over. And uh, it was Vikings who emerged victorious.